Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to another episode of Made in Japan here on Pastiche of Skin. Today we are checking out another visual novel that I have seen people bandying about, talking about, in fact that's going to get released into English fairly soon. I've got a stack of them to work through in my own time. I've got Steins Gate 1, well Steins Gate, Steins Gate 0, and Root Letter sitting in my little, uh, wonderful little shelf of games to play because I've got them for Christmas, but uh, this is something that people have been chatting about, it says it's very interesting, it's based on anatomy. <gasps> I know less than nothing about this, so we might as well start up and see what wonderfulness it has provided. According to the tagline, it's beyond the sky, into the firmament. I wonder what it's gotten to show us. I have no idea what this title is. You tell me. Ain't luck? I don't know. Okay. Hey, it's actually making a forward movement. Sprite! Ah! No! I know the show! This is, this is about a girl who actually wants to learn to fly, and winged boots are actually like a common thing, so they're kind of like taking part in like almost, uh, what is it? Like, uh,. Air combat tournaments, but you have to actually to use the boots. Is, I, am I right? Am I wrong? Am I right? Am I wrong? Come on, God! Why did it look like that in like the first shot, and then I'm actually completely making a tit of myself by guessing at that? Am I right or am I wrong? Is this a true? Nah, it's not. It can't be. Oh, right. There's pants. Never mind. Um. <laughs> Damn you, Japan! Wait, does she have cat ears? Okay, so one was a cat girl. Oh, there's the boobs again. Oh, there's more boobs. Oh, there's a bar of spaces. <gasps> We're going to sleep with them on holiday! Alright, no, this isn't what I thought it was. Completely not what I thought it was. <laughs> Completely different show, different thing altogether. Demon eyes, people making out. Lots of girls and guys. What is this? Okay. It, wait, is there some kind of flying in this? Or is this... Wait, they have... Wait, they do have the wing shoes! Wait, is this... Is this in the same vein as the show that I was thinking of? Or is this, like, just happened to be... There's two shows that have girls with shoes that give them the ability to fly? I am unbelievably puzzled. But obviously this is a visual novel based on... This? Beyond the Sky into the Firmament? I, whatever. I, I, I might be wrong, I might be right, but... Uh, this doesn't make it any easier for me to kind of like articulate this to anybody else. What the hell's going on? I can uh, uh, uh. I'm sure the levels are fine. I can't really tell much from what's inside the screen. Oh, well, that's how much of the sea... Uh, each, each character's voice? Well, that's particularly uh, impressive. They actually like turn somebody else up or down, especially if you really don't like that one character. You just go, like shut up, just sh shut up. I don't want to see you. Uh, basic controls, uh, speed through text, probably going to be X. <laughs> yes, I believe that is going to be the case. Uh, extra obviously is mini. Oh, what mini game? Why not give that a try? Piranha practicing. Okay. Uh, wait, what? Dark haired girl. Hey! Hey! Whoop, whoop, whoop. Hey! It's like a really simple version of Flappy Bird. Why? Whoa! Hey! I'm surviving well. Assuming I actually don't want to hit the walls. Ah! Okay. Nope. Never mind. Ow! Oh yeah! I'm kicking ass! I'm kicking ass! Oh! Oh! Oh, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, there's enemies against me! Ow. 
I, I have no words. I have literally zero words for what the hell was I just played. I'm glad that was fun. It's on sale, 26th of the 1st! No, we don't want to play any more of you. <laughs> okay, um... Let's game start. Let's just see what, what... Let's see what the main game actually is, because that mini game was mildly fucked. <laughs> Quick save, is that fun? I look up at the birds in the sky. I wish... I wish... I wish I could fly like them, free, in big open space. I've always been afraid of the sky. I just wish that somebody could show me how to fly. <laughs> I didn't want to be listening to the little girl panting over and over again. Thank you very much. Okay. Whoa! <laughs> I think I blitzed through that a little too fast. Uh, yeah. Uh, nice to meet you. You're sad. There's an old granny back there. Um. Okay, let's see what happens whenever we accelerate through this, because apparently I can accelerate through this at some high speed. Wait. Is... Are we literally going to watch the intro again now? No! No, we don't need to watch that intro again! <laughs> Unskippable intros! If I knew that, I wouldn't actually watch the one previously. Well, folks, enjoy this time by my commentary. Oh, wait, no, this is different? So the R fight. So this is the show I'm thinking of, isn't it? Ness? No? Maybe? I don't know. Oh, God. It's confusing me so much. Okay, it is introduced as our main cast of Spunky Redhead, long haired black girl, black, long black haired girl, young chibi looking blonde kid who's got a lot of spunk, quiet, quiet shy pink haired girl who watches everything happen. Go on, give us something a little bit more surprising. And of course, they're in swimwear with machine guns! Because that's obviously what's gonna happen first. I love the fact that there's actually poor rhythm across blue. It's, ooh, it's, so it's like synchronized air dancing they're doing? But the, um. The fact that they. Oh, yeah, this is. This is. I almost. This has to be the thing I'm thinking of. Like in the first episode, when she ends up actually like pulling off a move that nobody should really be able to do on the first time they ever wear air boots or so on. I wish I watched more of a show that I didn't really want to watch just so I could actually understand what the fuck going on here. Everyone's happy, then they're scared, then they're happy again. Making out and kisses. Loving hugs. Confessions of your deepest loves. Four characteristics you can choose! Right. Beyond the sky, into the firmament, deep beneath her brazier, underneath the skirt, slipping past the panty line. Alright, boots. People are unhappy, some are annoyed, there's people that are teachers that are happy. Oh, whoa! <laughs> that was a slightly risque looking teacher pose. Yeah, no, yeah, yeah, we're just flashing back to that again, are we? <laughs> Do you think the teacher was a bit weird? Look, I got fly feet! Oh my god, I'm going to fall! Gliding around in the middle of the sky I don't know how I'm gonna keep on flying So I'm assuming, alright, so in the show that I remember watching, they were allowed to use these flight boots to get to and from school, or if they were part of a particular flight stunt team or whatever. And in the first couple of episodes, one of the girls who was like an absolute beginner challenged somebody who was like from another school that was a master. So, I, I don't, I, I, this isn't the same show, this isn't the, but it has some very, very similar conceptual designs, I imagine. I, 
You brought me a pod lunch? Okay. Thank you. Obviously, somebody's already in love with me. So, you're the neighbor next door? Neighbor next door's little daughter? Neighbor next door's sister? Yeah, apparently, all of this is just confusing you as well. Don't worry about your feelings. It's okay. You can feel comfortable around me. You're just as terrified as I am. I have no idea what's going on. Whoa! Okay. Moving on. <laughs> just in case YouTube decided to make a comment about that. <laughs> And of course, she left her window open while getting changed. Yes. Yes, Japan. Yes, peeping toms and catching people unawares nude is true, true so are sources of romance, you know. Uh, I, I I knew I wanted her the moment I saw her uncoupling her bra. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I get you. I get you. I can understand. That's a deep, deep, deep feeling. Eh... Uh. Hey, Teach! What are you wearing today? The exact same hot pants? Kids, I can understand. Your school uniforms. Teachers! Wearing the exact same clothes every day. Hmm. I'm flying again! Yay! Don't show my feet, though. We don't want to animate the objects moving me through space. We just want to float in a single spot. It'll work this way. Ah! I'm here, too, now! I followed you into the sky. Ah. Uh, um, I. Do you mind giving us a moment? No. Well, I'm here too now. <laughs> Welcome to the party, Richter. Apparently, the other two are actually upset by this. Oh, what? They're falling. Oh no! Oh, falling through the sky. Gravity's involved. Things have gone horribly wrong. Everything's gone awry. It's over. They're all dead. Game over. There we go. That's how the demo ends. It kills off all the characters within seconds. <sighs> you go, girl. You fell in love with him first. You brought him the stew in the first day. If you brought him the stew, like, what's what's the old Kevin Smith phrase? It's like, eh, most girls will cheat on you, man. Not all of them will come to your work and bring you lasagna. It wasn't lasagna. But at least it was a stew. I mean, it was so good, my spoon stood open it. That's a proper stew. What does this bitch do other than fly? I wanna fly. So into the sky. Very high. Just like a dragonfly. Oh. I'm like a bird of seas. And on the beach. And on the breeze. And I can't sing. And my voice is weak. Today, I remember whenever I was standing on a beach and I had a sun hat, and I lost my sun hat because it got lifted by the wind, and I wanted to fly like my sun hat in the sky. Um, sorry, sorry, you were saying, um, uh, you're asking me what you were saying? Uh, something to do with a sun hat full of sand? Or was it a sun hat in the sky? Oh, considering you like flying so much, I'm going to go with sky! Okay, that makes sense. I feel like I've got a safe. I, I, I think I went with a safe bet. I think I went with a safe bet. Oh, she looks pleased. Okay, cool. <laughs> and my harem begins. The teacher's got an interesting figure. But uh, probably not going to handle it. It's just the fact that the teacher's belt is undone and the top button is there. Woman, please. Please don't do this to your students, it's, it's, it's probably not going to end well for them. The crosses at the top of the knee-high sock on one leg? Hello? Who the hell you are? Wait, is this the- oh, so this is the girl that- oh, so this is not true! I was right! I was right! I was fucking right! <laughs> this is a show about girls with boots that fly in the sky. This is the fight that I saw. This is the, the air battle where I've never really flown before. I don't know what I'm doing. And she pulled off this ridiculous fucking move. They're going like, only a professional could pull that off. And I'm like, fuck you, man. Like, this isn't a sports anime. Like, we're, we're not going to do the whole natural talent thing in this. It's fucking flying boots. <laughs> You're not a goddamn bird. 
のもいい加減にしてくれない、oh, here it comes. Yep, and the rules are flying. Flying! Flying Circus! <laughs> Welcome to Monty Python's Flying Circus as we run around in the lab and play tag with our flying feet. <laughs> I'm so excited! I'm ready to get my ass beat any second now! Uh, oh, well, you should have some fun with this. I can win! Yeah, I'm not gonna win! I have no idea what I'm doing! Oh! He beat me lap after lap after lap! I can't win this! Oh, I'm gonna lose! I'm gonna lose! Maybe I. I. I've got one last thing I can try. Ah! Pull off triple gainer spinning knock drop kick! She shouldn't be able to do that! I still win the fight, but um, she obviously pulled off a really bizarre move. Fair play, dear. Flying kick! Oh my god, it's amazing! I did I, I, but I didn't win, but I feel good about it. Oh, there. I, I just don't know what to say to you. All right, you should never do that again. I'm going to stand here like an imposing shadow, like an adult. You don't know who I am, but you're going to actually believe what I say. I'm really a big fan. Let me train you! So yeah, it seemed very weird that we managed to compete and take part in a competition like that and I got my ass beat, but everybody wants me to do it more! Maybe it's because I've always wanted to fly. Okay, I think we're getting to the point now where we're past the point of me and my knowledge of the show. I have no idea. <laughs> Apparently that was a commercial break. <laughs> is there more commercial breaks? What's going on? What is going on? We're essentially having a lesson between each of these. Huh? Oh? What? Huh? So, they're obviously together continuing with the lessons. They're getting further into it. I'm... I... I... I, 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 I'm, I'm holding this down as fast as I can, but... You can see just how much there is of this. The end of the first episode! And in the next episode, this is going to happen. And we're not going to care. I found this bus that was full of like rotten old leaves and things. And my teacher was there and she had her belt open. And she took off her belt and I don't have any memory of what happened afterwards. She did give me a drink beforehand. I don't know what was inside the drink. It tasted kind of funny. <laughs> Alright, guys. Thank you very much for watching. This has been uh, a made in Japan looking at. <laughs> looking at wherever the fuck this game show is. Uh, or this crazy ass show is. It's available as an anime on Crunchyroll.com. You can watch it. Um, I've watched the first couple episodes. Literally, that scene that we saw with the uh, air battle, I zoomed through and make jokes about beforehand actually did happen. I know it happened. Thank God I actually didn't imagine this entire show. The basic premise of this is in a world where hover boots are available. If the entire concept of girls flying through the sky in hover boots is a great idea to you, but they obviously, like most of the population, have not decided to stop wearing skirts, then this is the show for you. Take from that what you will. So obviously a lot of people said that either the anime or the TV show, or the, the anime or the books or the games are all slightly different. So this is of course a game based on an anime series and probably a manga series that came out before it. I'd be intrigued to see more of this, but I really couldn't watch the show too much. I just didn't get into it. It wasn't holding my attention. I like If it's going to be pseudo sports, um, I'd rather be in, like, in seeing pseudo sports rather than just hovery feats. So um, yeah, I didn't I didn't get involved in this show too much. Uh, if you want to see more of it, of course yourself, and you can decipher the moon runes better than I can. 
then feel free to grab it from the Japanese PSN store. And if you've been entertained by what you've just watched, uh, thank you very much for watching. I have, I'm enjoying just spoofing over these now whenever it comes to visual novels. Uh, I'll, I'll stop doing it whenever it comes to visual novels that are in English, but whenever these visual novels are in Japanese and I can have a kind of idea what's going on, I'm just going to say and do weird shit over the top of it. So yeah, guys, I hope you've been entertained. If you enjoyed entertained, make sure to hit the subscribe button sitting right up there. And it allows you to see every video that I post up as it comes up to the channel. Or you can go over here and you can hit a button that'll actually take you to something that I've actually done fairly recently. Somewhere in this region of the screenage. So yeah, guys, thank you very much for watching. And uh, like I said, you'll be able to see other episodes there. But until then, I will see all you do in the next video. Bye-bye.